Hello and welcome to KNR project. You can see that I have built a house here. So this is a smart house project. I have compiled the uses of all the sensors and then put it in this house. I have installed four sensors here. This one is a fire sensor and this is a light dependent resistor which acts as a darkness sensor and you can see a motion sensor right here and finally this one is our touch sensor you can also see a keypad and a LCD right here which is displaying inter password and this is our Arduino there are a lot of messed up wires the configuration is easy but you can see that there are many wires that's why it seems so messed up now let me explain what this smart house does so in the beginning you can see that welcome peeps is shown on the LCD so let me focus on the house so if I go and give some motion input to the motion sensor then you can see that inter password is shown on the LCD which means that this smart house detects motion from any intruder and then LCD displays inter password so if the motion is not given then you can see that it displays welcome pips once again so you can see I'm giving some input and then it displays inter password and on the keypad our password is 1 2 4 and 5 you can see it in the code in the description so let's check this LCD what happens when we enter the password you can see that I have given some motion input and then I'm typing 1 2 4 and 5 you can see welcome is displayed on the LCD which means the program is accepting our password and then telling us that we are welcome in this house so the program continuously goes on looping and then it continuously works for this motion sensor that's why whenever the motion sensor receives some input it always displays inter password so to prevent this from happening further I have installed a touch sensor here so as soon as I give some touch input you can see that welcome pips is shown on the screen so even if I give some motion to the motion sensor you can see that welcome pips is shown on the screen so now we have already we already have access to the house so let's go inside and see what really happens in the room so you can see that on the first room I have installed light dependent resistor so if we give some darkness you can see that the LED automatically starts blinking so this smart house also detects darkness and then displays the result which is LED blinking and you can see here darkness is continuously displayed in the LCD and finally in this room you can see that a fire sensor is installed so in case of any fire hazards what will happen let's check it out so if fire is detected inside this house then the LED turns on and then the buzzer installed here it starts making noise I hope you learn from the video and from my previous videos you can learn how all these sensors work so if you like this video then please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and please ignore these messy wires you can easily make a new room and then you can cover all these wires since I did not have a lot of time to make it I'm just leaving it as it is that's it guys thank you